Lung cancer is the leading cause of cancer deaths worldwide. It is the second most common cancer in the US. Most lung cancers do not cause any symptoms until they have spread, but some people with early lung cancer do have some symptoms. If you go to your doctor when you first notice the symptoms, your cancer might be diagnosed at an early stage when treatment is more likely to be effective. So let's see what are the warning signs of lung cancer. But before going to the discussion, you should know that these symptoms can overlap with other conditions and many of them are very common and mild. First thing, you should be alert of new cough, especially if you are a smoker. If it is due to common cold or other infection, then it will go away within a week or so. But if it is persistent for long time like more than 8 weeks, then you should think about the possibility of lung cancer. Next thing you should check is the sound of your cough. If it is deeper or sounds hoarse or you're coughing an unusual amount of mucus then it's time to visit a doctor. Check if you're coughing up any blood even if it's just a small amount of blood coughing up blood or bloody mucus could be an indication of having a lung cancer. Lung tumors can block the airway and cause frequent infections such as bronchitis and pneumonia. So if you have repeated respiratory infection then check it with your doctor. it could be a warning sign of lung cancer not all wheezing sounds and shortness of breath during climbing stairs are due to asthma or allergies changes in breathing can occur if lung cancer blocks or narrows an airway or if fluid from the lung tumor builds up in the chest when your airways become constricted blocked or inflamed your lungs may produce a wheezing or whistling sound when you breathe this can have multiple causes some of which are benign and are easily treatable however wheezing is also a symptom of lung cancer so always consult your doctor if you find any recent changes if you hear a significant change in your voice or if someone else points out that your voice has changed then visit a doctor a simple cold can cause hoarseness but this symptom may point to something more serious when it persists Hoarseness related to lung cancer can occur when the tumor affects the nerve that controls the larynx or voice box. Next thing you should check is the unexplained weight loss. When cancer is present, this drop in weight may result from an excess use of energy by cancer cells. If you lose more than 10 pounds within a short period of time and there is no significant cause for that, then you should immediately consult your doctor. Lung cancer may produce pain in the chest, shoulders or back especially when breathing deeply, coughing or laughing. When lung cancer causes chest pain, the discomfort may result from enlarged lymph nodes or metastasis to the chest wall, the lining around the lungs called pleura or the ribs. Next thing you should check is the bone pain. The lung cancer that has spread to your bones may produce pain in your back or in the other areas of the body. Bone pain is often worse at night and increases with movement. Other symptoms you should check are the recent headaches, loss of appetite, facial swelling and feeling tired or weak. People who have smoked have the greatest risk of lung cancer, though lung cancer can also occur in people who have never smoked. The risk of lung cancer increases with the length of time and number of cigarettes that you have smoked. If you quit smoking even after smoking for many years you can significantly reduce your chances of developing lung cancer. All right so that's all for today. Hope you like this video. Don't forget to like, share and subscribe to our channel. Thank you.